Alright guys, welcome back to more Ratchet & Clank Rift Apart. Uh, first off, thank you guys for all support on that first video. Was kind of unsure of how it would do. Uh, you guys are amazing. I I'm going to tell you right now, like, I've been making videos for 11 years and it's like I'm still to this day uh, just surprised. So, again, thank you PlayStation for the early copy. Um, you guys want more of this game quickly, just keep this running at like button. It's the fastest way to let me know you want more. Unlike the first video, recording this one. Late at night. <laughs> uh, it's 1.28 in the morning, so you guys are awesome. Let's get it. Where are you taking me? I was going to take you to my hideout. But first, I got to rescue my friends at their gelatonium factory. Yo, check out this environment. So we still have all the same stuff. Oh, wait. You can quick map these. Okay. Okay, well, I've already got them. That's maybe why if you look at the... Yeah, that makes sense. The weapon will... It puts them in, like, the up, down, left, right. I don't know. I mean, I'm guessing diagonal would also be something you could do, but that makes us so much easier. Okay. Well, now, now I know that. Yo, this area looks awesome. Does that have everything? Can we just go anywhere? All right, let's get, let's get moving. Check out the map really quick to see where we're at compared to... We got a collectible, which I'm guessing that's the same... Yeah. Now, we've already listened to this, but still got an exclamation point. Since the last video to now, I, I got like a small update. I have no idea what it actually did. So, we'll see. Rate of fire is amazing. But you also go through a lot of ammo, so I don't know the trade-off there, really. Is it worth it? You know what other game I hope that one day they actually do a redo, uh, or not a redo, well, I guess it would be a Naughty Dog game, would be Jack and Daxter. I think, they did. I think they're the ones that made that. I'd have to double check that. I hope I'm right. <laughs> I don't know, I still prefer, like, slowing down time to, uh, to select everything. Great, there's a Seeker Pete right over my hideout. I haven't been out this far in a while. Got a lot of swamp acid between here and the Mortz's gelatonium factory. Those beetles appear to have no issue with the acidic swamp water. Beetles, yeah. That's why I'm gonna ride one. As soon as I can get close enough. Oh. This wasn't what was in my account. Ooh, let's last check this time. one out. Oh, that is because I added our mutual friend on Nefarious City. Okay. I just think it's crazy, so I don't have enough for anything. I'm a re I, I like that you can replenish everything from this menu. Come on back when you need more sugar, sugar. I actually double checked it was the Honey Dog that actually made those, so I was like, I was. Wanted to make sure. But yeah, Jack and Daxter, one of my all-time favorite games uh, on PlayStation 2, at least. Yo, this area is crazy. Hold on. Hey, let's get it. What if you can, like, farm enemies? Like, get all your abilities and stuff. Let me see. Uh, haven't got any armor yet. Weapons, everything kind of stays the same there. Gadgets. What is gallery? Oh, it's just... Oh, it's just showing the, uh... The different types of enemies you fight. Okay. Interesting. I feel like at nighttime I can actually concentrate better. <laughs> it's like... Uh, I'm more focused, if you would. Where's that speedle going? It appears some dimensional distortion is emanating from that... That's a little too far away, I think. There we go. People said this is the best looking uh, PlayStation game ever, but I don't know. It, it's tough because different types of games use different engines. I feel like 
I wouldn't jump the gun and say it's the best game of all time by looking at graphics, but I would think that, yeah, it, it definitely looks amazing. Uh, I think that, uh, I'm trying to think like what the best PS4 looking game was. I, Cause I know like Ghost of Tsushima looked amazing with like the way they did like the colors and everything like that, but I don't know. And the last speedo runs into that rift. God of War looked amazing too. All right, smarty bot. What is this place? I um a dimensional pocket? Perhaps a symptom of the dimensionator's destruction. How do you come up with this stuff? It's Maynard, the Mortz's helper bot. Must have wandered in through the rift somehow. There is the Speedle. No, no, don't hide! Ugh. Hitting its net. Well, that ain't good. Uh -oh. Yo, let's get it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. No, I can't get off. I thought I should like destroy those boxes to get some ammo or something if I could, or uh, not ammo, but there we go. Currency. Oh yeah, you you can't really hop off. I'm just gonna have to go for it. Hold on. This isn't good. Hold on. No, I missed some. Get away from this acid. Come on, Maynard. Let's find the morts. I'm just very surprised that this game has been running as smooth as it has. I've not seen the rate tracing yet. I'm sure it looks amazing. There we go. I got it. I got it. See? Sometimes I don't crash. This is just so well done. We didn't follow that Lombax and his robopet across dimensions just to get stopped by some fuzzballs. So you got like nine and a half seconds to tell us where they're at. One. <laughs> Hang on there now. See, they are looking for Ratchet. I am telling the truth. Whatever, Bolts. I'm gonna save my friends. Hey, I know where you can find a Lombax. Rivet. I like the name. The, the gameplay, I think, is very... Just, oh, I didn't mean to do that. Very fun. Not... It's, it's like... I mean, I guess it's like a general theme with Insomniac Games. It's like that, uh... That fun, yet semi-challenging experience, they just make some great games, you know? Wait, can I destroy this? Oh, hold on. <laughs> Look at these guys. It's like you're playing a Pixar movie, you know? Only a lot more challenging. I've actually, when I was editing the first part, I remember like looking at the graphics. So I was just like blown away, like how smooth everything runs. So what did I just do? Mort, good, you're okay. Us? Oh, when we heard those fellas were after a Lombax, we were worried about you. The well, next thing we know, you're here saving our behinds. Wait, where are the others? Well, oh, some of the Morts are stuck inside of that mess there. Not a clue what it is. All I know is it keeps getting bigger. Oh, between that and our new neighbor up there, we are not doing too fine. <sighs> Don't worry, I'll take care of it. Oh, and to keep you all busy while I'm gone, got this at Zerky's. Mort can finally fix that ship she's been working on. Zerky's? Oh, those pirates didn't give you any trouble, did they? Eh, only a little. You can give this to Mort yourself once you get her from that purple mess over there. All right, head to the hideout. Enemy's not getting the point. Hit them over and. Yo, look at this gun. Pull the fire trigger to 
the ricochet. Alright, man, I want all, all of these, but I know I'll eventually get them. Alright, uh, I can buy... You got the phone, Should I save sugar? up for this? Treat refill really quick. Mm. I'm actually thinking I might just go with... Mm, I don't know. I kind of want this gun, but... I'm going to go with this thing. Because once I saw it, I was just like... It's like... Iron Man, it's like proton cannon, you know what I mean? That will See if we can upgrade anything. We got three points, let's see. But like the, I'm telling you, like the burst pistol just feels like the way to go. Um, yeah, it has to be these, man. Rapid shots, more accurate. I don't know. Hmm. I'm torn right now. I, I feel like maybe. Looks like you got some open sales and the rare what is this thing to deal? See, charge faster. Let's go ahead and get these. We just got this, but we might as well increase the duration of. Oh wow! Okay. Uh, faster charging or I feel like yeah, this might Make be best. Sure All right. What I'm gonna do really quick is I want a quick map. Let's put, let's put this on the right. Let's make this on the bottom. Eventually, they'll all be guns. That way, I can just do this. All right, I want to try this out in a second. <laughs> kind of eager. Let's go. Oh no! Hey, let's get it. Uh oh. Yeah, charge time definitely gonna be an issue. But look how pretty this game is. I had ammo though. Hold on. No! Watch out! I like how they're all fighting it too. Like we're all here together, buddy. I feel like for burst DPS, like this might be the way to go. Hold on, let me talk to these. Let's go, Shatterbomb. I like that you level up everything from just using it. Like, there's no trickery. It's just, hey, use it a lot, and you'll level it up. No more hostiles within range. Rufus, we raised the bridge to your hideout for protection, but the controls are lowered. Mm, let me go back over here to the shop. I just kind of feel like... Uh, like how I was able to just take down that enemy. After you kind of get the hang of everything, it's it's nice. All right, I really like this gun a lot. We can get these three. Max ammo. Let's get it. That's that all that you can upgrade. Now I see other. I guess other spots. Says 16% complete. I'm guessing maybe later on you unlock more. Same for this one too. 28%, but I've unlocked a lot. Um, we'll see. We shall see. And yeah, what is this? Nothing. All right. Apparently Sly Cooper's in this game, but I don't know if that's true or not. I don't know if somebody like modded something or did like an overlay. I saw it on Twitter, so I was thinking like Love maybe Lords, but they get way too it's excited legit. about hooking stuff <laughs> up to those pressure locks. Something this game does really well with this area versus like the opening area. Obviously, like minus like the parade. I mean. Don't tell me, my love thingy can interact with that rift thingy. Your rift tether, yes. Try aiming at a rift. I like using this. I don't know. It's just it's cool. And it disintegrates them. And I think from left like if yeah, if I keep using it. Level it up. Like you just put the ship too. Yo, let's get it.
Man, the graphics and everything, like, everything going on, every time I use, like, a different type of gun or ability, I'm just expecting, like, there to be a lot of, like, lag or something, but it never is. That's why we're good. Health has increased a lot, too. Yeah, it's like, it reminds me of like The Last of Us 2, where it's still like the very beginning, oh no, the very beginning of the game, it's like a very linear pa like path and everything. Then after like the first hour, which is like my part one, it opens up, it's like a whole new area, but it, it does feel like a little more free roam style, which I like. I, I don't know, now I, obviously I can't go anywhere, but... Maybe it's more of an illusional uh, type linear path, if that makes any sense. It's like like in Telltale games when they, they give you a choice, but sometimes the choice doesn't really change the outcome. <laughs> it's a comparable thing, I guess. It feels like I can go anywhere, but if I bet if I hop in like, the water, it'll take me back or something. Let me just try it. I'm, I'm curious. Okay. Okay, that, that makes sense. There are limitations. We've learned that. Ooh. I will take that. Thank you. I really think that this... This story as well is really engaging. Oh, no. Am I really... Hold on. Oh, yeah. Hitting that guy in midair is going to be well. Never mind. This is going to be difficult, but... I <laughs> kind of took bridge. care of him. Wait, can I go over here? I guess if you wanted to go back and forth, I could just do this. We got half of the bridge. Let's see if this will move it at all. You will not succeed in jumping across. Just scoping it out. Hold on, let me. Oh, I should have stayed on that. I guess I could just do this. If I really need to go back over there, I don't have to wait for the other one. Do this right here. All right, so we gotta figure out a way to get the bridge. I don't know if the, the person said, like, you could jump, maybe? I'm gonna try jumping. I was, like, partially distracted there, so let's just see what happens. I think I can make this. Oh, no. No, I'm not making that. <laughs> it's like, nope! Can't do it! Um, let me look at the map really quick. All right, so we got investigate the dimensional anomaly to save the morts. Okay, uh, these are all main things. Head to the hideout. Yeah, so we're still doing the same stuff. Wait, hang on. Back over here. Maybe we'll get something from being over here I first. Let's see. Suggesting this, but what about the speedle? What about it? Oh. Uh, here we go. Okay. Do not enter. Got it. May I take a look? I have some experience with dimensional anomalies. I... Sure. Hmm. Huh. Huh? <laughs> Greetings! Welcome! How did you get in here? Where exactly is, um, here? Oh, you don't know? Well, I don't either. It appears to be a space between dimensions. Uh, could be nothing. Could be a cascading entropic fissure that will soon turn the entire universe into a formless soup. Time will tell. Oh. Oh, dear. Well, I am Clank. Please allow me to help. Right, yes, Clank. 
I am the all-seeing cosmic prophet of interdimensional sector 2255 phase Omega. But you can call me Gary. Here we are, Clank, former warbot, uh, teamed up with the Lombax, became a hero. Who good for you? Ooh, ooh, friend of my father. I see. Your father? You might just be the one I've been waiting for. Would you like to help me fix the dimensions? You know how to fix the dimensions? And why are there copies of me running around? They're your possibilities. The key to repairing I was kind of following them. Hold on. First, pick up that nearby sphere. Can I make this? Okay, I can. The loading times this game, you don't have any downtime. Hold on, let me go back over here. Nice. I love the variety in this game. This a lift Ooh, speed. hold on. It can reduce the gravity on any object it touches. It seems your possibilities are what keeps an anomaly from collapsing. They look like you because that's how you interpret dimension. Oh no! God! It's like I'm getting everybody else over there now, but I'm not kidding. If you can guide them to the meta terminal ahead, you will begin to repair this anomaly. Now. Enter the meta terminal and you'll be one step closer there we to go. fixing this dimensional anomaly. I feel like things are slowly starting to make sense, dimensionally speaking. Ooh, let's see what this other one is. Yo, they the this game uses like the coloring really, really good. Like Ghost of Tsushima. Or Tsushima, however they wanted to say it. It was like the a speed sphere. That'll get you moving. Hmm. It's I like they made everything so vibrant. You know. That barrier. Do you live on oh, it just breaks too, through. Nice. Savali, actually. I've been studying in the archives. It's the greatest repository of dimensional knowledge I've ever seen. I don't think I need... I, I think I need to use this one. Right? It's gonna bump them up. This right here will make them slow. Yeah, they're missing it just barely. So let's try that. Get this back really quick. I don't know which one I should do first, though. Oh, wait. Maybe if we're going slower. And then... Oh, let's try it. Uh, Looks like it's a little bit backwards. Let me get this one back. And then this one back. This should be on the other side. Right on the edge. That should do it, right? There we go. Hey, let's get it. Oh, no. Hey. Or not. I, I can't make this for some reason. It's like everybody else got to cross this fine, but uh, there we go. Do I got some serious air time? My possibilities. There must be a way to activate it. All right, I need to take uh, I need to take this other one back. There's something down there. Um, all right. Hey. What about through here? Nothing. It's almost like I'm supposed to be. Uh, let's see. Let's just put these back over there. Because obviously we have to have them coming this way. Which then should bring them back over here. Which would lead to this. We got to turn this by standing on this, I'm guessing. So they go forward, maybe. There we go. That's not good. Outstanding! You seem to be a natural at this, Clank. I am cautiously optimistic. I feel myself learning something by completing these puzzles, but I cannot explain what it is. The words will come to you when you are ready. 
Now, lead your possibilities to the final meta terminal. And not to stress you out, but there's a lot riding on this. Like, a lot, a lot. If I fix this anomaly, will that fix all the damage that has been done in this oh, dimension? No. Oh no. Anomalies are spreading too quickly to do that. I'm afraid a dimension oh, is is coming. Dash through. Oh wait, even if you walk into it, it, it takes you out. Okay, you can't make that. Indeed. But if repairing anomalies is helping you learn about mm. dimensionality, I think you'll soon be able to learn enough to save us all. Hopefully. I Problem is, if I, if I will be able put to solve this. all of this in the end. What makes you say that? It has been a long time since I have been a hero. And with everything that happened with the dimension... I did the green one for this. I am concerned. In times of great stress, which seems to be every day of my life... <laughs> I've always found it best to take things one step at a time. Focus on what's in front of you. Hmm. That ain't good. So, I don't know how I can do this. So, it's like, you gotta get them from that side. Let me go over here first. Let me get this one. Bring this back over here. Because I need this a lot. So, we can hold two, two of these now. I don't know what this is gonna do, but... Uh, we actually need to put that over here. Hold on. I didn't mean to do that. I hope I'm not interrupting your process, but I think there are more spheres left to find. So essentially, they want you to get all of this first. I need to use the red one right here. All right, so it looks like. Hmm. This is not going to work on that one. Yeah, red, I mean, I, I can get the other one right there, but I would have to get... Let's see if this thing on the bottom can be maneuvered a little bit. No? All right, so now that we have... Let me get this back. Keeps that there. Okay. Now... What does that do? Makes it 20 times faster. Okay, nice. <laughs> uh, that's not good. How do I... I, I, I got to figure out how I'm supposed to get the other one. If I could bring the red one over here. Let's try it. If I, may offer one if I can get up here and get this, I can stop both of them. Be beneficial to explore the area for more spheres. There we go. This feels lighter than air. Huh. All right, this should be easy now. Let's get this back as well. All right. <laughs> what we were doing wrong. All right, so now it's a matter of we got to get them to go straight right here. So we got to get the other green right here. Oh, wait, yeah, if we're standing on this... Yeah, it'll... Okay. We don't even need to have that other one. Because we've already got that. So we actually need to bring... Uh, red needs to be on the outside. So we'll do that. And then bring this back over here. That should launch him. I hope. That's it, Clank. You repaired the anomaly. And now we're one step closer to stopping the dimensional cataclysm. All right. That that's 3 out of 3. I don't know how many more of these we have. I like the way it's set up though. Nice little puzzle. So then I says, "Listen, Mort. You Morton Mort better hide that lemonade before Mort shows up." Whoa! You saved them! How did you do that? I... am uncertain. Rivet! How the heck are you? Look who it is! <laughs> <laughs> you would not believe my luck today. My trip to Nefarious City went totally sideways. I wrecked my ship and I... Uh -huh. You go on and leave that one to old Mort. <laughs> well... Assuming you brought that part I asked for, hmm? I'll have this old thing in ship shape. 
<laughs> Just gotta lower the bridge and then I'm taking you to my hideout. What are we going to do there? You'll find out soon enough.